So I would like to share something with our listeners, something that Ryder and Will were actually two of the first people I told the news to. Uh, I was recently diagnosed with DCIS, which stands for ductal carcinoma in situ, which is um, a form of breast cancer. Boy Meets World star Danielle Fischel is opening up about being diagnosed with breast cancer. On the August 19th episode of her podcast, Pod Meets World, the 43-year-old revealed the cancer was found early. It is very, very, very early. It's technically stage zero. Mm -hmm. Um, To be specific, just because I like too much information all the time, uh, I was diagnosed with high-grade DCIS with microinvasion. And I'm going to be fine. I'm having surgery to remove it. Mm. I'm going to be on some some follow-up treatment. Um, I've had to make a lot of decisions over the last couple of days. Talking with her co-host and former Boy Meets World castmates, Wilfred L. and Ryder Strong, the mom of two admitted she previously thought she would suffer in silence and not tell many people if she were diagnosed with cancer but now she's sharing her diagnosis with listeners because she hopes her story will encourage others to get checked. My first instinct when I was diagnosed was to do that clam up thing, was to be like, okay, I have to share this news with Jensen, of course. And then I wanted to share the news with my mom and my dad and my brother. And then outside of that, I was like, I'm going to just pick a few select friends. And then what I realized is the more people I talk to, the more people had their own experiences, either themselves being diagnosed with cancer or a family member who's been diagnosed with cancer. And the world of resources and experiences that can be shared by sharing it and things that can be learned. The only reason I caught this cancer when it is still stage zero is because the day I got my text message that my yearly mammogram had come up, I made the appointment. And the fact that I am good about going to my doctor's appointments when truthfully, it would be so much easier with as busy as I am with the 50 jobs I have and the two kids and a husband and a house. It would be so easy to say, I don't have time for that. I went to my mammogram last year. I was fine last right. year. I don't right. need to go what again this year. I'll, yeah, right. the, it's going to be fine. I was fine sure. last year. And I didn't. Instead, I was like, yeah, it's time. Got to make that appointment. And they found it so, so, so early that I'm going to be fine. Wow. And so I want to share this because I hope that it will encourage anyone to get in there. If it's time for your appointment, if you've never had an appointment before, get in there. Worse, if you have to find out that you have cancer, find out when it's at stage zero, if possible. Will and Ryder shared their support and love for their friend. Well, we love you, and you know yeah. that we got you. Thank you. So whatever, whatever you need, we're here. And if you need to miss some, or we need to postpone stuff, we, it's the last thing that you yeah. need to worry about. So. It's mind-boggling, mm-hmm. right? Like right now, no joke. My wife and I know four people, four friends that are dealing with breast cancer specifically. Yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. it's just, it's the age, it's yep. the time we live in. I don't know, but yeah, definitely get well, it. It get seems checked, to be checked. more prolific. It seems yeah. everywhere, and and for men too, you know, prostate exams and mm-hmm. colonoscopies. colonoscopies. I mean, yep. yeah. these are Do all it. things that are super important. So don't put them off. Um, and we're so glad you didn't. Yes. Because yeah. you are going to oh be fine, gosh. and part of the day you might have some sucky days coming up, but we're we're here for you. So whatever. Yeah. I know, I know you are. Thank you guys, and uh, yeah, we love you. So. Thank you for being here for this episode of Pod Meets World. I'm Danielle Fischel. I'm Ryder Strong. And I'm Will Friedel.